more discipline. Do you know how to... You think you can figure this out? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Get out. Stop, <laughs> Gary. I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So, tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel your filthy little fantasies? Gary, just get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or... Wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening Ow. him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, oh, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, Ow. peace stain, before you mark the carpet. Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go help that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off. <laughs> Sorry. <Boop>. Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, what are you, a wimp, Bucky? You see assertive? Check this out! I don't care anymore! This you is it for you! you. stuff. She's pretty smart, though. <laughs> I got a pretty keen sense of I'm style. going to catch you! <laughs> Don't stop! This is great!
Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. Thanks, Jimmy. That's great. Here, take this. Jimmy comes through again. Sounds good. Care to prove me wrong? I can't believe Lola actually talked to me. Ooh, I really gotta go, but wait for someone in there. I'll wait. about you nothing you're lucky i have someone more important to be life is suffering then you die
wouldn't be so bad if you just cleaned up a bit. Come on, help me out here, please. Okay, now all we gotta do is get back to the library. Yeah, I guess so. Lame oid. I'm gonna tell someone you did that. Did you ever tell your mom? No way. What are you, crazy? Did you ever try to do something just to look cool? I got a job to do, kid. I didn't even know you could get a Why are boys there. so confusing? I just don't I get smell that. free food. I wish I could do something wild and exciting, like go to the big city with a boy. Show me some documentation. You'll be prosecuted to the max. Stop that Woo! immediately! Hey, Beatrice, what's wrong? Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Secondly, Mr. Hatrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, yeah, there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is going to know about. We're like doomed lovers. Enough. Okay. I'll get your book back. Then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over. Yes, I was a student at Bullworth before becoming the renowned brain surgeon that I am today. Oh, cool.
Are. Did you get it? Yes, I did. And I didn't read it. Much. Much obliged. I hope it gets easier. Jimmy Hopkins delivers. I can't believe anyone likes convicts. I mean, they're like, you know. 